Welcome to Hawaii. For the next couple of days, I will be Sol's surfing coach, or attempt to be, as she tries to hit her goal of surfing an unbroken wave for the very first time. So, the next couple of days, we'll see how it goes. Recently, we booked a spontaneous trip to Hawaii with the sole purpose of surfing. I really wanted to set myself a goal as I knew I could get surf fit again. Last year, I had a major setback when I perforated my eardrum and was unable to surf for almost one year. Since then, my surfing journey in Australia has been on and off due to my work and laziness. Hopefully, I'll be able to comfortably surf again in the next couple of days. But for now, let's relearn the basics. Alright, so when it comes to paddling, you lock your, you lock your wrist. Yeah. So when you when you got your chest on the board, you reach out in front of you, like to the nose of the board, and then you drag it back. It's there. Okay. Yeah. It's not like at the same time. To get there. Well, you don't need to jump. Yes. Otherwise the board will... <laughs> they look like they are, but they're really just moving. Yeah. So there's two different types of riding away. One is goofy, one is regular. Goofy is where you've got your left foot at the back of the board. Regular is where you got your right foot at the back of the board. I just don't know where to put my feet because this one is a really long board and there's way too many room. All right, so you flip the board over. So you want one foot about here in this region here. You don't need to be all the way back here because you're not going to be turning too sharply. So about about there, right on the right on the edge. And then your left foot, you want it to be about here. There's so many steps. Ah. So when it comes to getting in the water itself, you have to be very careful of a couple of things. Being aware of other people is very important because other people might be very new to surfing as well and so boards could be going everywhere or just other people swimming. When it comes to the currents, you can get sucked out a long way. You can get current, like, currents going down the beach as well. And then when it comes to the rocks under the water, there's not much you can do about that, just be aware. And that's why we're falling flat versus pencil. When it comes to surfing, it's not very thick. What I got it is, but I know I did something wrong. Yeah. But I don't know what. You put a little bit too much weight on the back of the board, um, and you want to put a bit more weight just in the center. That's the uh, your function. Alrighty, so session three. How are you feeling? Um, I feel a bit better after a long night of sleep. Session four, so? I know in session three, Aiden said that 
I actually caught an unbroken wave, but it's not good enough for me. So hopefully this session or tomorrow, because tomorrow is the last day, I'm going to get it. So unfortunately, our GoPro actually died. The, a bit of salt water got in through the door and it's totally, totally destroyed the camera. Yeah. But during our last session in the water, Sol was actually able to complete the task of surfing her first unbroken wave, which was great because I also got to do it with her. But because we weren't able to film it, it looked something in between this and this. Success aside, we found Hawaii to be a bit of a mixed bag because the place we were staying, we felt that people were just showing off how expensive their life were. But when we drove on the north shore of the island, it was just amazing to be that close to the nature. We found some wild turtles, we went snorkeling, and also we were able to watch the sunset at Pipeline. Honestly, being at Pipeline, I was just in awe of these guys. The legends that were there were just surfing barely a foot or two above the reef and it was just incredible to watch. That being said, Hawaii was just the start of our two months holiday and we are so pumped to create way more content to put on this channel. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to follow us on our different socials so that way you don't miss anything. So thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one. Woo!